Hi, I'm Joy Heimgartner. I'm one of the transplant dietitians here at Mayo Clinic, and today I want to talk to you about the importance of drinking enough fluids after you have a stem cell or bone marrow transplant. All of our body's cells need fluids to function properly, and staying well hydrated is really important after you have a stem cell transplant. Staying well hydrated can help side effects like nausea, dry mouth, and thick saliva be a little bit less intense, and it might also help you have a little bit more energy. Also, it's really important to stay well hydrated to keep your kidneys healthy. Drinking enough fluids when you don't feel well can be a real challenge. Also, common side effects of stem cell and bone marrow transplant like vomiting, diarrhea, and fevers can make your body lose more fluids than you usually do. For this reason, it's really important that you sip on fluids all day long to meet your needs. So what are your needs? Well, how much fluid each individual person needs is different. As a general guideline, we say that most adults need about two liters of fluid or eight cups of fluid per day. Your personal fluid recommendations might be greater or less depending on if you have other health conditions, but your doctor or your dietitian will talk to you about this. Fluids can come from a variety of sources. If you're eating well, drinking water is a perfectly fine way to hydrate your body. Other fluids count as well. Things like milk, juice, sodas, and sports drinks can also help you hydrate your body. And if you're having a hard time eating, these things can also provide some calories or protein that you might need. Your doctor may ask you to limit caffeine during this time, but it's really rare that you need to totally avoid it. Remember also that there are some foods that are a good source of fluids. Things like ice cream, popsicles, soups, and jello are considered fluids, and so they're a good option during this time, especially if you're having a hard time drinking. Sometimes it can be difficult to drink a lot of fluids at one time because it can actually make you feel more full and bloated than you usually do. For this reason, I usually suggest that patients try to sip on fluids all day long. This is usually easier to do if you have something like a travel mug or a water bottle that you can carry with you and sip all day. Some of my patients have had really good success with reusable hard cups such as these because they find when they see that there's something to drink, it reminds them they need to drink, and when it's easy, you're more likely to sip all day long. Just remember that with any reusable cup, it's really important that you are the only person using it and that you clean it every single day. Don't be surprised if your care team asks you to write down everything that you drink each day because it's that important. Start planning and practicing now for how you can achieve your goal of drinking at least eight cups of fluid per day to feel better and be healthier.